so at, uh, here it comes, here it comes, there we go. Yeah. See, I was going to play that right away. I don't know what he was thinking about. Uh -huh. <laughs> he was giving us some time to risk. We appreciate that. Oh, I'm going to get some water. Mm -hmm. So this uh, great, oh. <coughs> so AlphaGo is kind of putting the time screws to him now. It didn't even, uh, Well, it's all driven. Um, it's interesting because in some points it was thinking when one of his stones was under Atari and it had an obvious move. It was taking some time. To do um, but this also, in, locally, it's, it's kind of, this move that White just played was a forced move. It right. was the only move that anyone would think of. And so it's pretty natural to play it quickly. Yeah, the next move is, can we look at, at what, uh, what okay, Black's Black options has, uh, are here? The, I just the normal move would be to play here. And now if Black is worried about the right side group, some players would be worried about the right side group, um, the easy way to settle this position is to play a double Hane here. Right. Um, hane is a diagonal move against your opponent's stone, list, so that's, that's a Hane. And it's a double Hane when you have two in a row. Um, white will cut here. And now if white uh, connects, trying to save all of white's stones, um, this looks sort of awkward shape for white. Black has the advantage that all his stones along here are solidly connected. 